Since his rearrest in 2021, the embattled IPOB leader Inande Kanu has been in the custody of the Department of State Services as he awaits trial for terrorism. A federal high court in Abuja had granted him bail in 2017, but he flouted the bail conditions and subsequently fled the country and was thereafter rearrested. Former President Muhammad Buhari had resisted pressure to release Kanu, but with the entry of a new government, fresh calls are being made for the IPOB leader's release. However, addressing journalists after a meeting with President Tinubu, the Niger Delta leader Asari Dokubo said Kanu should not be released and must be made to face the law. You encourage people to kill other people. When the madness they call NSA started, I was one of the people vocal opposed to that nonsense called NSA. And Inam Dikanu was walking free. What did he do? He poured petrol. He was walking free. He poured petrol on the flames for NSAS. Now, he has been caught. What of the people who have died? This is a criminal. He should face the law. What of the people who have died by, as I'm talking, Inam Dikanu does not have any control over the, what is happening in the Southeast. Simeon Epa had come out pretending that he's with Inam Dikanu. He has actually plotted a coup against Inam Dikanu to take over the leadership of IPO. That is the truth of the matter. So releasing Inam Dikanu is rewarding criminality and rewarding gruesome murder of innocent people. He should face the law for the actions and the instigation he has carried out. The Kubo further spoke about crude oil theft in the country, accusing the military of masterminding it.